Today I'd like to show you how to be a detective for ash dieback disease in your own plantation in the winter time. This is a very fine plantation of ash trees. It's 22 years old and we want to check the shoots in the crown to see if there's any ash dieback disease in it. To see if you have ash dieback disease in the crown of your trees, you need to cut down a branch. And to cut down a branch, you need a pole saw like this one here. Here we have a shoot from the crown of the tree. Looks perfectly healthy, nice green color on the stem, typical black buds of an ash tree. On the other hand, this is one that also comes from the crown of the tree. We can see a green color here, but evidence that we have an infection with a change in color from green to a brown orangey color on the stem. In this case, the infection is in the middle of the shoot, but we can also find evidence of dieback from the tip of the shoot. In this case, the tip has died back, a change in color to a brown, and it has moved back along the stem into the green part of the wood. Perfectly healthy here. Now we're beginning to see some brown tissue. And it's completely brown on the inside there, corresponding with the brown on the outside of the stem. Here we can see the brown stain due to the Calara disease, which kills the inside of the stem. Ash dieback disease has been confirmed and identified by the Department of Agriculture in this plantation. But if you want to check your own plantation, take shoots down from the crown and examine them carefully for changes in the coloration as we've shown you.